Have you ever wondered what forecast model is the most accurate? With PredictWind's validation tool, you have the ability to see which model is currently doing the best job for your forecast location. The validation tool compares each model's predictions relative to a real-time wind observation near your forecast location. Please note, we only have comparisons in the 1 km resolution forecast areas. We can view the validation data in two formats, tables or graphs. In this tutorial, we will cover tables. From the main menu, click on Validation. First we see the tables format. One day means we are seeing the average error for day one of the past weeks or past months forecasts. We have the wind speed table and the wind direction table for each period. In this example, we can see the Spire and Predict Wind models have been doing the best job at predicting the wind speed and direction for day one of the last week's forecasts. Further down the page on the map, we can see the observation location that the comparison data is sourced from. When we click on 7 day, we get the average error for all 7 days of the forecasts. Again we have the average error for the past weeks or past month forecasts for each of the 7 days in the tables. It is interesting to see the change in the model's performance as the days from forecast run increase. This gives a good insight in the model's strengths and weaknesses for this location at this time. In this example, we can see that ECMWF performs well, especially in days 4 to 7, compared to some of the other models. The data in the validation tables is updated each day.